we still have that rain around, but the good news that rain's going to come to an end just in time for the weekend and that sunshine will return for your Saturday and Sunday. That rain was needed. We have had only picked up about three one hundredths of an inch of rainfall before today, but today at the Youngstown Warren Regional Airport. Now this was as of about five, five fifteen. Th over three quarters of an inch of rain has fallen and that there will be more added on to that total as we progress throughout the evening hours. Temperatures say we're cooler. We had high temperatures in those middle to upper 50s. That was this morning. Temperatures were in those low to mid 50s for a majority of the day. We still have some spotty and scattered showers around. We'll keep spotty showers around throughout the evening hours, but then that rain will start to come to an end overnight tonight. This rain's associated with a cold front. This cold front has worked off to the east. Behind that, high pressure slowly is starting to build in, and as this builds in, we'll see that sunshine return as we head into the day tomorrow. But in addition to that sunshine, we're also going to see some cooler temperatures as some cooler air is slowly starting to work in uh, behind this cold front. Temperatures will be below normal. But we have high pressure building in. That's going to bring us sunshine, dry conditions. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and then we have another system that's going to bring us rain, the potential for a few snow showers and some colder conditions as we head towards the middle of next week. Temperatures right now still in those low to mid 50s for most, but that cooler air is starting to work in. Temperatures middle to upper 40s, places like Bristolville at 45, Newton Falls 48 degrees, 47 currently at the airport. It's still 53 in Minerva, Lisbon, 53 in Newcastle as well. We'll see these temperatures drop out of the 50s through the 40s, eventually dipping down into those low 30s as we head towards tomorrow morning. Rain comes to an end as we head throughout the next couple of hours. We see mostly cloudy conditions overnight. Temperatures dip down into those low to mid 30s to start your Saturday. Saturday starts out with those clouds around, mostly cloudy conditions to start the day. But look as we head towards the afternoon, clouds clear out. Skies become mostly clear by your Saturday evening. Saturday going to be cooler. Temperatures low to mid 40s before afternoon highs. We see temperatures dip down into those low 30s under mainly clear skies Saturday night. Sunday, I do expect to be mostly sunny and I expect it to be warmer than Saturday as temperatures will climb into those middle to upper 40s for afternoon highs, even low 50s for a few spots as we head towards your Sunday afternoon. 32 tonight, those showers will stick around for the evening hours as well as some gusty conditions. But overnight tonight, that rain comes comes to an end. Clouds start to break. We see mostly cloudy skies to start the day tomorrow, but by tomorrow afternoon, we see that sunshine return. Cooler conditions, high temperatures, low to mid 40s for afternoon highs. We're into those middle to upper 40s for your Sunday. Mostly sunny conditions, a nice day expected. For your Monday, partly sunny skies, temperatures in those middle 40s. Now, again, another system's going to roll in, bringing us rain for your Tuesday, upper 40s. Rain and even a few snow showers possible Wednesday, but look at that temperature. Upper 30s, low 40s for afternoon highs. For Thanksgiving, scattered clouds, very small chance of a shower, mainly in the snow belt, but temperatures going to be in those mid 30s for most, even low 30s for a few spots. Friday temperatures slowly try to rebound low 40s, partly sunny skies.